Yo, yo, this is Ross. And Kathy. Team Ultra Pedestrian on day 30 of our Grand Enchantment Trail yo-yo attempt. Um, things are spinning out of control, getting away from us. We've uh, hit some crazy weather, had a storm come through yesterday while we were um, trying to go up high onto the um, uh, Muggy on Baldy route, yeah, which would have been up at 10,000 feet. And as we were starting to climb up, it was snowing and starting to snow harder. And it just didn't make sense to be climbing and hoping the snow would stop. Um, we're out of stove fuel. Our feet were still wet from all the uh, fords on Mineral Creek. So we decided to take the uh, high country bypass and ended up down here at Willow Creek. Um, met some good folks. This is Tyler Wallen and Jim Brooks, Howdy. who were kind enough to uh, come over and uh, check out our tent this morning and offered us a pot of hot water, which was an amazing blessing. And there's uh, peanut butter and tortillas in store for us. They've just been generous and kind, you know, like you expect sort of on the trail from country people, but like modern folks don't necessarily expect from one another and that's always one of the amazing blessings about being out here uh, so jim tell me your impression of the like the snowpack and the creek conditions right now well it's i mean it's down we were here a couple of weeks ago and it's down a lot a lot from what it was maybe half uh this has been probably one of the better winters for snow in the last 10 years and still maybe barely average but uh but this is kind of one of those storms you you can never predict, but they show up and it's fast and furious and it's gone. And in a couple of days, it'll be in the 60s. So yeah, <laughs> not bad, not bad. We, weather should get better the whole time, but you might see another storm, who knows? Right. Oh, probably, I yeah. would expect so. So um, yeah, so we took the high country bypass. So that's our, and we're gonna take the high water bypass as well, which adds on a bunch of mileage. Mm -hmm. But uh, so that's going to be asterisk number one on our only known time. But uh, yeah, it's just uh, what we got to do. So we're still just enjoying the blessings of this adventure and uh, having fun being in over our head and dealing with making decisions and uh, routing around what we have to and pushing through what we can. Give thanks.